Hello YouTube! Welcome to another installment of our travel channel. Today we're visiting Jiayi, located in South Central Taiwan. Jiayi's claim to fame is Ali Shan. That's a mountain resort area located high in the mountains above the city. Jiayi itself was notable for lumber for much of its existence, and there are several reminders of this when you visit the city. It was during Japanese colonial times, we're talking late 19th to mid 20th century, when Jiayi became the hub of the lumber industry in Taiwan. Hardwood trees such as cypress are abundant in the Alishan area to the east of Jiayi, and a railway was constructed to get these trees from the mountains to the sawmill located in town. Hinoki Village is a colonial area where the lumber industry was centered. There are several restored Japanese-style houses here, which accommodated lumber industry workers and executives. Today you'll find a quiet, tidy quarter of town with an assortment of tourist facilities, like souvenir shops and the odd cafe. It's a nice place to relax for an hour when it's hot and muggy, which is most of the year in my experience. Along with the Japanese houses, this area of Jiayi City has a variety of sites related to the lumber industry and the lumber railway. Check out Alishan Forestry Park, which is adjacent to Hinoki Village. The park ties together several attractions like the Sawmill Museum and Railway Garage. If you don't have time to take the train up to Alishan, go inside the Sawmill Museum, where you'll find a large screen video presentation of the scenery along the route. If you have a few minutes to spare, go see the dome in the Song of the Forest Park. It's only a five minute walk from the Alishan Forestry Park. The dome is made primarily of iron railway ties and was designed by an artist from the Alishan area. Another important attraction near Jiayi City is the southern branch of the National Palace Museum. This is located in Taibao City, around 10 kilometers west of the center of Jiayi. The museum is a sweeping modern structure built of concrete with large glass panels and angular metal buttresses. The landscape park around the museum is worth a trip for some exercise and recreation, even if you don't go inside the museum. As always, if you enjoy our work, please like and share the videos and consider subscribing to the channel. Happy travels!